Hi, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. Today is another empty, um, you know, another season go three months and 2021 nearly to the end. We only have another season left. Oh, wow. Yeah, this year it goes through past very fast. Uh, I think still in down to the pandemic. Um, well, but it gives us more chance to self-care and use all the products. So uh, to people who are new here, my name is Tiana. Welcome to my channel. I'm a girl doing some random beauty review stuff and also show you some cool subscription boxes. If you enjoy subscription box, feel free to come to my channel. Also, I love fashion, so I have some fashion um, kind of clothes try on haul Victoria's Secret if it's that's what you love or I also doing fast fashion like um, show Paul um, Princess Polly misguided and boohoo kind of clothes if you're interested have a look my playlist uh, give me a subscribe and like I would be appreciated okay let's Let's have a look what product I finished for this season. Three months. There's like half basket of stuff because it's a quite long basket. So I will say oh, the result is not too bad. <laughs> so what I finished first, it's a mask. So when you work from home or when you have a bath in the weekend, I will use some mask. Uh, I have some sheet mask which use on the bed. One is this basic Garnier Skincare Fresh Mixed Tissue Mask. Uh, you need to put the liquid, um, pour it in the front so the thing in front, the sheet in front can soak it so you can use it. But I found these things, it's a bit uh, extra because yeah, I just prefer a sheet already have stuff on instead of you need to pour your liquid yourself. I think it's a lot of work, but yeah, it's hydration. Uh, this is a, a new brand from Australia called Jar.com. I don't know anyone know about it. They have some hydration mask come out. So I just got from a subscription box uh, and have a try. I think it's all right, this one. If you're interested, you can have a look. What's next is uh, Bunny's Clean Clay Mask. I got, I think, a sample. It's from sent from America. I have two of these samples. Uh, it's like a clay charcoal mask. Um, uh, can clean your pores pretty good. But just for, don't forget to take it off after a while. Otherwise, it will make your face very dry. If you are a combination or dry skin, you need to be careful. Okay, let's talk about dry shampoo. I use the classic shampoo. I'm not a dry shampoo person since last two years because oily, my hair get oily, you know, very oily hair after a couple of days and I'm not like a person like to wash my hair often. Yeah, a little bit grubby, I know. But um, yeah, I just try to spray this and keep my hair look not that oily. Uh, this one is simple, easy. Uh, just, you know, when your hair is dark, I dyed a bit brunette kind of look, but I originally is black hair. So when you spray it to roots, it will have colors. You just need to remember to rub very, very hard or just spray far away. Make sure, otherwise you will have white stain left. That's it, but it's cheap. It's easy to use. You can buy it anywhere in supermarket even. So yeah, it's the same on my, you just buy another flavor, have another try. Cheap, easy, quick fix. So next it's, I finished the Bass Body Works Sea Salt Lime. This one I'm putting in the kitchen. Um, I love this kind of lime stuff in the kitchen. So kitchen, you want to be fresh. So this is a good one I used. In the future, I might buy it again. Similar flavor, different products from Bus Body Walk. Or maybe I will buy the same uh, hand wash. Who knows? Okay, after this, let's talk about another hair care. It's a painting uh, conditioner, foaming conditioner. I never tried, but it's very cool. Um, painting. I never used the foaming one. It's very interesting. 
um, the bubble once you squeeze it's like ginormous and you can just all rub around your hair it's easy to neutralize i feel like because it's bubbly um easy to do to go all across your hair you don't need to use plenty product because the bubble can help uh yeah it's easy to perform but if you say it's a very good product to make your hair smooth i'm not sure it's just basic uh, after sh hair wash make it not too dry kind of conditioner yeah i may get similar product that began because i found the foaming one it's easier to use than normal cream one i don't know you maybe you should try i think it's a new thing new type of the conditioner uh finish a basic toothbrush nothing to say just okay okay it's too big i like i probably buy smaller one so i can change my toothbrush quick this is the victoria's secret um body cream called good vibes or goodbye i just like the things this tell you always be positive have good vibes not give you a bad mind things in the pandemic you need to always think positive so you can go through every day energetic right so I like the smell. The perfume um, lotion is great. I just use it for ages because I always forget to put body cream on me after shower <laughs> until I feel itchy, my skin dry, itchy, so I will remember to put it on. But I managed to finish it after a year. <laughs> I know it's long. Some people using body cream like load of load of for just a season. But for me, I really used for over a year. When I will buy it again, um, Victoria's Secret always buy it, but typically this one, I'm not sure. Too many to choose, you know? Okay, after that, I still have more mask pop out. This one, it's just a little bit too creamy for me, but I still have a couple. It's the uh, JM Solution Glow Minions Aurora Mask. It's a bit too um, glowy, not glowy, too creamy. So I'll use it in bath. So it's a bit better because when you're on the bed, it's too much cream and drip everywhere. It's getting messy. So it's good in the bath, I reckon. Uh, this is like a violet ash mud mask. Yeah, it's great. Just a little bit muddy. It looks like you can't just come out from the beach. You see, that's not sand. It's the mud inside the mask. Yeah, it's cool though. Um, I might do it again. You can get it in Priceline, those pharmacies. Okay, next is this Botanical Fresh Care. I got it from the one of the pharmacy, like a good health pharmacy. Uh, because they the flavor is very interesting. It's coriander strange cube shampoo. So coriander, so oh, use spice in hair care. So pretty good. Uh, I enjoyed it. Uh, it's a good one. You should try. <laughs> Okay, let's talk about bath bomb. I actually use a lot of bath bomb. I all put in a jar um, to use it. And every time when my partner go to sh shower, go to have a bath, it just randomly picks them out to use too. So we actually use very quick these days because we can and we like to have a bath. Uh, this one have a package because it's body, um, body shop because you know a lot they don't have package so can't show you but this one is like a coconut bath bubble uh it's a blue little heart when you throw it in and they make this water look like ocean blue very cute very nice smell good and the whole heart didn't really all dissolve in the water i don't know why though so yeah i leave some for second use if you like to use twice you can try they are dissolve very slow after that, I'll talk about the Lush wrap here. Um, I used a lot of bubble, bath, bubble bar or bath bomb. So yeah, Lush is one of my favorites, so just general. <laughs> After that, let's talk about the eyelashes. One of my favorite eyelashes, um, those Unicorn Comestic eyelashes from, uh, I think it's a British brand. Uh, you can get it online they send it to, uh, worldwide uh, i got a lot of 
eyelashes and some of the cool makeup from them the eyelashes is look very real and fluffy or just suits on all different types i have small eyes and i managed to get a lot of um, lashes from them which not look too much uh, they make those fox wink ones which i can use uh, not very fluffy but look um look very i don't know how to say but it just look good on the small eyes there you go um next it's a ma another mask a cucumber mask so i have some still a little bit on the side i just can't really finish it but yeah kind of all finished peter thomas peter Tho P peter thomas thomas Ruth, oh my god, I can't read it. Peter Thomas Ruth Cucumber Gel Mask. It's very cool, cooling and nice on, on the face. And I like cucumber, you know, just like what I said in Bath Body Works with a video, make me feel fresh, like a fresh, clean vegetables <laughs> on the face. Not like a Bath Body Work cucumber one, clean body. It's just nice, clean, hydration face. <laughs> um, then people's favorite Serum V hydration cleanser. I use this. Uh, not really feel much difference on the skin. Just clean generally. Um, it's cheap and it's okay to clean the face. So I might buy another one. A big bottle maybe in the future. I don't know what this um, perfume is. But smell very good. It's a perfume sample and then I finish it. I'm very happy about it. Um, finish some of my other eyelashes from the whole package from uh, T TK Max. So yeah, we'll keep using more. Today I didn't wear lashes, so someday I don't feel like it. <laughs> um, I finished this Felicitas hydration serum I won from their giveaway. This Australian brand uh, I had I found it online. On Instagram but they don't really have much update these days I don't know whether they still do it but their serum is great and my face feel hydrated I recommend you try to try next uh, another Garnier one I have a lot of old classic Garnier one uh, Garnier just always a brand that I always gonna buy um, their hydration hydro bomb tissue mask this one you don't have to uh, put your serum from A part to B part which is simple and easy I might buy more of this compared to the other one you have to do so many different weird steps I'm just a person want to do easy job on face instead of making my own serum on the mask sheet you know <laughs> so yeah it's a cool one now let's talk about a drunk elephant I finished my Drunk Island Hydration Serum. It's a very good one. Um, great on the face. I just love it. I probably in the future gonna have another one of this. I feel highly recommended. Just a little bit expensive to be honest. And yeah, but if you want to try those things, just go to Mecca, ask for samples. It will give you a tube, go back to try it free. You have your choice to try um expensive things you don't have to pay then you can like me buy a big bottle to enjoy if you really like it okay so next it's a ysl perfume mon paris it's a little bit strong so i tend to not spray too much when i use it but i finished one sample pack i have couple from my social soup campaign yeah this one it's all right um it, i but i think there are other one like the uh other one like might be better they, they have some new one comes out i don't remember the name but i think that smell is better because this is a bit too strong on paris but if you like um those strong um flower scent you might like this one all right talk about lush i just finished one of their hair mask it's pretty great it's almond scent it's a little bit too strong the almond except that i really enjoyed it it's called i and k i and b hair moisturizer it's great uh, if you don't mind the scent you can have it and uh, mascara here is sense 
volume hero. Yeah, it's great until it start get clumpy after three months. So I just chucked it. Um, and I finished the Japanese face cream on a trip. Like a, I use this trip. Trip. It's like a oh my god, so Sakura. Uh, Sakura animation <laughs> kind of things, uh, face face cream. I got in. Oh god, you probably can't really see. Probably uh, too bright. Oh god, yeah, it's the little fly fly mouse stuff on side from the Sakura anime. Yeah, the cream just very basic hydration stuff I use on travel. Uh, in the future, I might not buy this exactly same when I go back to Japan. Maybe one day. But yeah, we would love to try all different Japanese beauty products still. Uh, after that, well, I have a sample from um, one of the Gypsy online website. The hair wash is a bit weird, the shampoo. Uh, so it's very liquidy, so I finished. I won't think I'm gonna buy it again. Um, finish the one bamboo toothbrush is more environment friendly but you know bamboo is easy to get moldy so moldy on some part of my brush so i don't really want to use it again okay uh last but not least is uh winter collection bath and body works uh hand foaming cream called bright winter sky uh smell very good uh winter scent like apple cinnamon kind of stuff very sweet and nice. I finished it. Yeah, I loved it. That's all I have for this three season since um, May, April to August or May to September. Yeah, hope you like it and let me know what you finished. Comment down below and uh, see you in next video. Have a good week and be positive. See ya.